Hello, welcome back. This is Kenji1913, and we are Let's Play Sukuden 2. In the last episode, we were able to sneak in the, the Highland Army and find out how much uh, stuff they had. But I wanted to show off one thing, this fire ceiling thing. Void fire, but water damage times two. So that's not bad. We can give it to Zamza, and he'll actually, that rune, he'll just use it constantly and be fine. Anyways, let's get the hell out of here. Uh-oh. They're blocking the way! What are we gonna do? Which... Which tent should we go into? Hmm, what about this one? Right here. It's the biggest one and it looks different. Who are you two men? And look who it is. It's that girl, Julia. And actually, Julia is uh, the... Um, she's the br the sister of Luca Bright, Blight. And um, he... He is, uh, Luca Blight. The thing about him is, like, he's sadistic, of course. He's got, and he's got a reason behind it, because what I'm happening, I guess, back in the day, I don't think they tell you about this. Uh, I remember reading, like, um, the Sukoden, like, uh, what the hell was it? Like, they used to, th this game actually is missing a couple pieces that they wanted to add in, but they couldn't, I think probably because of space. But anyways, what I'm happening was way back in the day, the king of Highland, who's called like Argus Blight or whatever, he uh, he was uh, going along somewhere one day with him and young Luca and his wife. And what I'm happening is these bandits took took control of this. You know, they they kind of basically hosticized him, and uh, basically they raped his mom without his dad doing anything, and that basically kind of scarred him for life. Like, cause I guess he was, he was an alright guy, but not anymore. So he, like, that kind of, like, snapped his whole, uh, his whole point of view thing, and he went crazy after that. And that's why he's so brutal. And I think he, what ended up happening was he ended up killing those bandits later on. And look, Julia. And so she's a, she's a, she's a, uh, she's, she's a, uh, I don't want to call her a rape baby, but she is. And yeah, so the king was powerless to do anything, so he was pissed off. Anyways, uh, we're in here. I just kind of want to explain that story. I figured this would probably be the best part to do it in. And she's the princess, and she's going to serve us tea? I'm not sure if we should have tea. While, uh... While we're capped, while we're trapped in here like, like rats. So I guess we're gonna have some tea with Julia. Guess we did. Not even close. Well, I guess I will someday. I'll please you, maybe. I mean, it's not the people that are bad, it's really the, uh, the higher-ups. My brother Luca, do you know him? Yeah, I know him. stop him is to destroy him. Yeah, the tea was delicious. Well, who knows? Maybe we will. Maybe after this whole war is over, we can hang out. Anyways, now we can just leave. If you didn't get that fire ceiling ce ceiling Rune, you better get it now. Anyways, let's get the hell out of here. I thought so. I could tell the princess was opposed to Lord Luca, so I kept a lookout on who pops out. You guys, get ready, state spies. Uh-oh. Kill them! So yeah, now let's do a buddy attack. Let's get the hell out of here. Take down your Highland scum. There we go. Boom. Then 
we get shoulder pads. Nice. Could always use those. Uh oh. Yeah, I can't do that. Come on. Go. Oh no. Joey's gonna, uh. Joey's gonna. Oh no. Shut your mouth. Save my friends. There's plenty of meaning for me. So we gotta get the hell out of here. And yeah, that we won't be able to use that that awesome ability for a while now. There they are over here, huh? What? What? All right, let's take on some Highland Army guys. You know what's interesting about the Highland Army? Now that I think about it, they're very well tanned. You notice how tanned they are? Yeah, you like to power the bright shield ruin. Oh, you don't like it. Alright, let's get out of here. Run, run, run. Yeah, jo Joey will be with us shortly. We gotta get out of here first. Here, they're still here. Oh no! So yeah, we gotta get escape. Run away. I never know if she's carrying Bonaparte like that. Yeah, he'll be alright. I guess so. You know, he kind of sacrificed himself so that we get the hell out of there. So let's get back to Muse and tell him how much longer we they have. They got two weeks before Highland comes in and wrecks their A. Ah, just do an auto battle here. Alright, let's continue running down the muse over here. Alright, here we are. Thank God we made it. Yeah, let's go see Jess first. I'm sure Jowie will be here any minute now. <clears throat> Anyways, let's come up here and go see uh, Jess. Tell him what's going down. Where is he? Yeah, but we need to see Jess. Where the hell is he? Is he? He's, isn't he over here somewhere? I can't go in. But yeah, look who's over there. All those people. Maybe we need to go see Victor. Yeah, maybe Victor can get us in. He's pretty cool. So yeah, they're hanging out at the, uh, the bar. Victor, we need your help. Oh look, they're drinking a lot nice. But Joey. Yeah, he's not here. What happened to Joey? Well, you see, <laughs> he sacrificed himself. What? So they've captured Joey? Well, maybe if you guys came with us, there'd be no way they'd capture us. Yeah, let's find out what Jess is doing. I'll show you a good trick. Alright, so Victor and Flick are gonna join the convoy, nice. He's gonna show us a cool trick. I like that. Let's see this trick that he's gonna show us. It's a good trick, I think. I think he's used this trick before in the other game. 
What's your business, Lady Annabelle's preparing for a meeting? Oh, just a huge punch to the face. Good trick, huh? It's the best way to deal with government workers. Let's go in. Alright, so now here we got Jess. And we got two other guys. Yeah. Oh, and this is Fitcher. I asked him to do it. Now get your hands off me. Yeah, you having kids be spies? Well, they only—they got two weeks worth. You is—is is that all you? Yeah, just two weeks worth. Yeah, what are we gonna do about getting Joey out of there? Pretty much, he's pretty much, uh, he's pretty much screwed. No, he, it isn't. All this guy thinks about is diplomatic, and then this guy's like Gandhi with his no violence. How dare you, mercenary? We needed information to save me. Besides, it's your fault and Lady Annabelle is suffering. Why? What? Yeah. Well, if we had our own fort, we'd get the hell out of here. Anyways, that other guy was Lord Hauser. He's uh, basically the military uh, general in Muse. The, there was a black guy. He didn't really say anything up there. He's Hauser. Yeah, it's Joey. I'm sure he'll be fine. You're right. Well, I'm going to wait Joey about by the gate. I guess we should follow her. And Palika's probably going to want to come too, aren't you? Go outside and wait for him. As good friends, that's what we do. He said he'd be back, so he's probably going to be back eventually. No, I'm going to wait with you. Where the hell's Palika? She's supposed to be here. It's Labria. Why are you waiting? Listen, why do you want me to go away so much? Hey, here she is. Palika. Yeah, Joey will be back. Don't worry. I feel like, uh... I feel like, uh... Like, we're this little girl's buddies now. And watch on Namine and, uh... Palika just hang out. Mm-hmm. Yeah, he will. <laughs> Any other cool stories? No, what the hell? I'm not waiting. I'm waiting with you, damn it. I don't listen to you, alright? I don't care if you're my big sister. Why don't we tell some more stories about how people get lost somewhere? Oh, he cried the whole time. What a crybaby. I can't wait to bust his balls about that. Oh, 
too bad. I don't know, Balika is falling asleep. This guy's making us wait this long? What the hell? It is pretty late. Let's go far away from here. Like, where? Look who it is! <gasps> He's back! Oh, Isn't that so cute? Yeah, you came back. Yes, you did. Welcome home! I'm tired from waiting, like I'm gonna say that. Yeah, isn't this nice? Isn't this nice? Look, you'll never, you'll never ever betray us, will you, Joey? Never ever. Right? We're such good friends. How could you possibly... How could you possibly even think about it? It's been a week since we've been back? That means there's only a week left for the Highland Army. Yeah, let's go. Let's check it out. Let's check out the meeting. Okay. We got fun music, yay! Let's check out Jalston Hill! It's up here. This is uh, where big ass meetings take place. This is the city state, all of them getting together. Maybe we'll, uh, we'll have some stuff happen. Look at that view out there, wonderful. Hey, Victor! What's happening? Yeah, so this is a meeting, and they're going to call it the Hilltop Conference. Leaders of the five city-states basically muse. There's South Window, which is south of here. Green Hill, which is west of here. Matilda Knights, which is northwest of here. And I think that's it. Yeah, it should be pretty cool. So Victor's going to join the convoy. Yeah. Don't you reckon my face? My face is proof of my identity. Shut up, cat. <laughs> yeah. You can't punch your wo you can't punch this lady. And of course they know flick. You're the mercenary soldier, the one flick of the blue lightning. Please, please go in. How come they don't know my face, but they know your face? Well, he's pretty. You're kind of like... You're kind of rough around the edges there, Victor. You're kind of rough around the edges. Anyways, now let's go check out this awesome meeting that we're going to have. Hopefully they can all unite and take down the Highland Army. Mayor of Mule City, Lady Annabelle, and Jess. And this guy is Gordy Gorudo. All the way, girl. He's a big fat knight. You creep, what are you doing? And this is Camius. Who's like their vice? He's like the captain of the guards or whatever. And uh, Miklatov. Yeah, 
Yeah, he's just making sure a lady is alright. Damsel in distress and all that. Hey, hey, did you hear that? He called me a lady. Leader of Matilda Knights and White Knights, Lord Gerudo. Representative General of Two City, Lord Makai. Acting Mayor of Green Hill City, Lady Teresa. Mayor of Tinto, Lord Gustav. Mayor of South Window City, Lord Grandmayor. Commander of Muse City Forces, Lord Hauser. So let me go from left, from the bottom, and to the top in the thing. So on the bottom here is Hauser. Then the next one up is Teresa with her bodyguard Shin. Then you've got Grandmire, Lady uh, Lady Annabelle and Jess, Lord Gerudo and his two knights M M Miklatov and Camius. Then you've got um, what was the guy from South? Uh, what was the guy from Two Cities? And then you have Gustav there. They'll all talk, I'm sure. But I just want to make sure that you guys and gals know who everyone is. Makai, that's it. Wait a minute, aren't they still in compliance with peace agreement? Yeah. They destroyed, uh... Tricked by mountain bandits. Yeah, I don't, I don't think they could have been crushed. And yeah, Hauser is a black guy, which is awesome. Mm-hmm, that's why things are different. Oh, what? So, jeez, man, that guy is a jerk. It feel like all the other guys are kind of, uh... Well, most of the guys are kind of nice. Yeah, he is more demon than a man. Yeah. I'm not afraid of your threat. What good is it if I protect Muse and my people and the people of Tinto starve? Yeah, just join them. Kind of reminds me of some meetings happening in a Game of Thrones world. The Highland Army has slaughtered our border guards and they're headed for Muse. What? It appears they were serious. You all heard, I'm ordering you to gather your armies. Hmm. So yeah, it looks like there's gonna be some... some shit going down. And you know what, we're gonna have to... Can I not? There we go. And we're gonna have to deal with uh, that. Yeah, and look, isn't that neat? I didn't even notice this before, but here's all their sigils. This must be South Window. This must have been Green Hill. This must be, uh... Who's in here? Oh, Muse. This must be, uh, Tinto. Uh, Two River. And then Matilda. Yeah! That makes a lot of sense. Anyways, I'm gonna stop the episode here. In the next episode, we'll have to prepare for war. Uh, what is it good for? Absolutely nothing. See ya!